Each of the four tones in the patch are able to respond in some way to three patch controllers. Okay, what are the controllers? I'm talking about things like aftertouch, modulation, C1, C2, or maybe even the foot switches on the back here. Okay, well I've got a patch set up here. And I'm going to go to F3, control. Right, well we see here the common source. Now, there are three of them, and number one is reserved for modulation. And we can use modulation to do a particular job to all four tones independently. But I'm going to show you how to set up aftertouch to control the cutoff frequency of the first two tones. So let's use common source number two. First of all, select which controller you're going to use. You could use modulation, breath control, foot switches, whatever. But I'm looking for aftertouch. There we go. Now, aftertouch is pressure. As I push down on the keys, I can make some control change. But at the moment, it's not doing anything. As I push down, it has no effect. So let's select edit for tones one and two. So tone select one and two. I'm going to choose the target parameter for this pair of tones. There we go. Cut off is what I'm looking for. And then the range of change. Let's go plus 30. So that should now operate the cutoff of the filter on tones one and two. Let's try it. There we go. As I push down, the filter opens and closes.